Okay, let's get started here. This is the way your Android box is going to look when you turn it on. When you turn it on, you can see the different icons. So what you do is you arrow over to settings. You got Wi-Fi or you got Ethernet, whichever one that you have. I have Wi-Fi. So when the Wi-Fi comes on, it's going to bring up all the access points. Okay, so you scroll down to an access point, you click on it, and you put your password in. Now, I already have mine set up already. So I'm going to go down and click on mine. And we'll click down and connect. Once it's connected, it should populate inside of there. Now, in your remote control, you have a return button. It's right next to the four arrows on there. So you hit your return button. And then you're all set. You're ready to go. So on the video thing, the main thing that runs this device is Kodi. So we're going to click on Kodi. Now underneath Kodi, you're going to find different icons. You're going to find the videos. You're going to find music and programs. Those are the main ones that you're going to stay with. On each video, you're going to find something different and each one do, does it. I have 25 icons in here for 25 different things that you can go to to get your great experience of what this thing absolutely does. So we're going to first click on Genesis, Lazarus, okay? And you can click on movies, okay? You can go movies by year, okay? You can go by people watching, box office, whichever way you want to do it. You can go by genre, okay? So let's go by year. We'll go by year, and we'll go to 2015, okay? And on the 2015, you see a next button here at the bottom, so you can bring up the next button, next set of uh movies okay so let's just click on this one right here call focus at the bottom right side you can see it's working it's pulling in a different stream and each one of these movies on this particular channel Janice Lazarus has different uh, streams at the bottom right corner it's got 82 streams so you click down to the first one and you click on it okay and you click on it and see if it works. If it does not work, then you go to the second stream. Okay. There's that movie coming in. So the circle right there, we push OK to stop it. We go to the right where the square is and come out of there. So that movie will on that. But if the first stream didn't work, you go to the second stream. So we're going to return button on the remote control. It's got four arrows there on it next to the OK button. And to the right is the return button. To the left is your home button. It takes you back to the home. And we'll just go there right now to show you when I hit the home button. That's what it is. And again, we drop back down into Cody. Okay. You can scroll up and down, right or left, to find the movie that you really want. And you find the streams that's working to, to play that movie. Now, on the remote control also, you see lines at the bottom left there. Those lines got favorites and things of that nature. So if you look at a movie and you don't want to go back to it, you just scroll down, add it to your favorites. Okay? So next time, you don't have to go back looking for it. If you look at the bottom right side of it, it's just it populated in there. Okay? So we hit your return button. We go back out. And we'll go down to your favorites. And there are movies just inside of there, okay? Everest, Jurassic Park, okay? Now, if you hit the little lines again at the bottom left of the arrows on the remote control, now you can see what it brings up. And it says remove from favorites. So you remove it after you watch it, okay? So at the bottom right, it's working. It's going to erase the Jurassic Park movie. And we do the same thing, hit the same little arrow, and we go down and remove it. But you can add as many movies in there as you want, so the next time you have to go back and look look at it. Okay? That's Genesis. Okay? Now underneath Genesis Lazarus also, you have TV shows. So you go to the TV shows. Okay? You got your search. You got your genres. You got people watching. Things of that nature. Okay? Works the same way as the movies. You pick it up and go to whichever one you want to go to and do it. 
but you can also do a search here to pull up the different type of movies or TV shows that you like. So we'll arrow over to one and we'll just type in one to give you an idea. Okay, let's just type in this one right here. And then you go down and you click done. At the bottom right corner is working, there's power that came up. You click on it and it takes you to the first or second season. So you click on the second season and you just bring it up. And when you bring it up and things of that nature, it brings up the streams also. Okay. That's Genesis. I'm going to hit the return button, return button again. And I'm back out to this. Hit it one more time. A couple more times. And then we go into Zeus. All these icons are things that you have to work on yourself. I show you the basic of how to do it and everything like that. And then you go in and figure out what you want. Now in these Genesis, you got all these things to populate. And you go in and figure out which one you want to watch. So let's just tick click onto one that says on demand. Or you can click on the one that says countries. So we click on the one that says countries. And it brings up all the different countries here that you can click on and bring in the different countries that you want to watch. Down here at the bottom, it's got USA. See the flag there? So we just click on USA. And then you can go in and pick out what you want. It's got one of 36 pages, and there's 26 pages. 21 items, I mean, on here, not 21 pages. And you just go in and find one that works. Hit your return button. Return button again. Okay, you can go to live streams. You can go to sports. You can go to TV add-on on demands. We'll click on TV on demands. Now the box does have on here, it has anywhere from kids to adult programming, has all kind of movies, all kind of TV shows, okay? So you can click on it and, and you can find out what you really want to watch. But it's impossible to show you every one of these streams or what they do, okay? As you can see, they populate in there, okay? And they populate to whatever you'd like. One channel works the same way as Genesis. We'll go over to Sports Devil. I'll show you Sports Devil. And Sports Devil, you go down to Live TV. You go to iLive World. And then you hit All. And now you have a lot of these things here. 19 things and you come up and then you got your next button at the bottom. And you can go to the next ones. Okay. Give you an idea of what this one does. Sports Devil. Okay, and you go in and find out which one you like, and if it's working, you can add it to your favorites. Now we're going to go over to Phoenix. This is one of my favorites. Okay, we'll go over here and click the left arrow on the remote control. It'll bring out a box, and you go to thumbnail. So thumbnail, you got the different icons here. I'm going to show you three of them. This one right here is called Rock Crusher. And Rock Crusher, you can bring up the movies from 2015 also. Okay. Now, one of the things about that I like about this one is the fact that you don't have to look for the streams the way you do on some of the other icons. Okay. So let's just say the movie uh, Extinction. You click on Extinction working at the bottom right and there you have it that movie is pulling in right away you didn't have to go to a stream cancel that out okay we we'll hit your back button the return button on the remote control hit it again now that was rock crusher let me show you what's on the stall that's where the rock roller is okay and then you got the 2015 movies also again it's just full of everything Again, you can go over to the thumbnail, okay, and you get all the movies.